Welcome back everybody. Hope you're having a good day today. I wanted to show you a little uh, grouting hack, if you will. A um, little trick I picked up. Actually, I never heard of it before, but I thought, you know what, this is, there's gotta be a better way to do this. So I, I grab, put tile on my um, shower stall here in the, in the cabin and quarter inch grout joints. It's natural sleep tile. And a natural sleep tile, tends to, your grout really sticks to it. It's hard, really hard to remove. Um, so to come up with an idea, rather than putting so much grout all over everything and working it in the, in the grout joints, I took a old caulking tube that was used and I cleaned out the inside. I pulled the little cap out of the inside of it. Sorry, I've, I've been using it this morning, so it's got grout all over it. I pulled the plug out of the inside of it Cleaned the tube out really good, it's a plastic tube. Um, hooked a little hole in the plug and put a little washer and a string on there. It's not really a washer, it's a, it's a penny. How about a copper disc? Um, put that in there with a string so that I could pull it back out and reload it. Uh, just kind of a reusable caulking tube. It's working great. I'll, I'll show you what I'm doing in here with it and just wanted to pass it along. It's just an idea for you guys if you're doing any tile work. Easy way to grout your joints. So here we go. String just kind of hangs out the end of it. Just like you was putting caulking in. Gets, fills the joint completely full. You don't gotta make a mess with all your grout. I'm sure that there's um there's some of you guys out there that do tile and that are actually experienced and know what you're doing. I am not a tile guy by any means. But I'm not afraid to try stuff. This just gets the joints full. Mix my grout just like I would if I was doing regular grouting. This way it doesn't get grout all over. I mean, I still got grout on there, but that's where I wiped it down before. But it's not as bad. There, it's empty. So then I just take my fill in any spots that got missed. Seems to work pretty good. Right or wrong, I'm doing it. Seems, seems to work good, so. I am not, like I said, I am not a tile guy. But I also don't pay anybody to do my work for me. So.
makes it easier on me at least seems seems to then I'll refill my gun because it's getting low again shoot it in them joints seems to be working fine hey y'all so I was using that uh, caulking gun and my makeshift caulking tube with this grout and it was working really well I, I ended up stopping using it just because I, I mixed up enough uh, grout to do the entire shower so it was taking me a little bit longer to do it that way having to fill, refill that tube so I done this whole wall with it that way and then I just changed over and I done just the corners where it's a little harder to get the grout into and then went back to the traditional way of putting grout in uh, just because it timing wise it it was I didn't want to waste all that grout uh, I didn't want it to set up on me so I got all the grout done I'm on I think my fifth bucket of water uh, wiping wiping down the walls with a sponge and just figured I'd let you know how that ended up going and I'll show you what it looks like when I get done. it down until we get clean water all the time it's turned out good this is actually the first time I've ever done slate tile it's it's natural slate tile so there's a whole lot of imperfections and it annihilates a sponge all the little edges and where it's flaked and stuff just rips the sponge apart but if I had to go to a different sponge my regular tile sponge has been torn up so I'll keep washing. Well, I got the all the tiling done. I'm still sponging it, wiping it down. She's about done. I think it turned out pretty good. I didn't get a lot of video of this, but we got the grout all in. Probably need one or two more sponge baths on it. Put that pebble floor down this morning. As soon as the um, thin set set up, I went ahead and got it grouted to day two. Still working on sponging it down. It's I only got it two or three times over it and had a fan on it all day keeping this getting this stuff to dry quick for me so I could keep on going but it's been a good Saturday got a lot done this Saturday now I gotta go put a um, scale together and weigh some 4-H pigs <laughs> 